The the uh, many of them. I'm not saying excuse me, can't say all, but I'm saying that's a lot, a lot of ministries are doing. So we got to watch out for that. <laughs> but the people use scriptures. That's how we got into that that talking to to get you to do something opposite of what the will of God is or the word of God. In this case, we're talking about Satan trying to kick, tell Jesus, jump, commit suicide. That's what we basically are doing. Go ahead and jump off that cliff. And how many people do other things the same way, right. trying to, and 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 yet you should do it Christ's way. Christ said, "Was well, written again." Because in other words, he's saying that I hear what you just read. Yeah. But maybe I need to show you something else that's written because you that 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 dog ain't hunting. So let me tell you, let me rightly divide that word for you. It is written, "Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God." You know what I mean? So now look at the last one, because this is the last one, guys. I'm, and I'm sorry we went so long, but I'm going to break up a segment, and I know that's still not good enough, but that's okay. But my point is this. This is where I think superiority complex uh, all the way from, and I think it's not just uh, you know white supremacy or black supremacy. I think people come into the church ministries and how they put down people they call sinners as if they forgot that they were sinners and they forgot the fact is that they still have some issues they they too busy trying oh, yeah. to judge somebody else right and, and i call that vain glory because could look at this one right here this is the one this is the most critical one i think that's why he did his last come here he was in the wilderness for 40 days right yeah. in 40 nights right it doesn't mean so, that this is when the temptation started no nope. He, he was, was tempted, tempted at all points. From the time he got there. He was tempted. He was. And and I think people don't understand. Remember, I think it's James, right? He was tempted at all points. Yeah. Yet without sin. These three, I think, was meant for people to, to look at. And that's, yeah. this is the I'll biggest just... one. This is the biggest one, though, Brother Asher. I want you to pre preach us to this one. Teach us on this one. What, what is this, this saying? Okay. Then, uh, Seth. Let me see. Okay. Did he do the tempt Lord? Yeah, it's eight. Start at eight. Because you already did not tempt the Lord that okay. God. Again, the devil taketh him up into an exceeding high mountain and showeth him all the kingdoms of the world and the glory of them. Mm. And saith unto him, All these things mm. will I give thee. Mm. If thou wilt fall down, and worship me. How many people have done that? Oh, man. how many there's, people have done there's, that? There's, 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 there's got to be countless. There's, that's there's, that. That's it's still happening every day. It got a master in it, Father. I'm concerned that when you talk about even this, 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 this form of racism and everything, oh, and I'm yeah. talking about not just this white racism and and black racism. That there's just even the ministries to sit there. You you should have mercy and grace toward person who who's going through challenges you show no mercy you show no grace as if you never been in that position yourself you act like you are what called infallible yeah and you love to put other people down because they they what do you call it? I can't stand this I can't stand sin I hate sin I hate yeah. sinners like you want one what the Bible say? If you say you have not sinned, you're a liar. You're a liar, which makes you a what? A sinner. <laughs> you, so you, hate, you basically you hate yourself. <laughs> you just you understand. That, that's and and it's, it's, it's like you never did anything wrong. You you see what I'm saying is as if you have your stuff so much together that you can sit there and talk about somebody else, and to the point that you want to condemn them, you want to kick them out, you want to reject them. Before vain glory, you want to say that? I mean, I don't mean to put down some people. Some people just said this: I don't smoke, don't chew, don't hang with people to do. That what Christ did? No, no. that is not what he did. 
that is not what he did, but that's what, this is how we came in. Some people got churches and ministries, they don't want nobody else in it. Yeah. No, man, we just us, just us. We don't need, somebody come in new, they look at them. Oh, everybody looking at them, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, how dare they come in here? If you ain't you know? saved coming in here, don't come in here. Don't they come in here. Don't it, like, what is your it, purpose? What is the purpose of your ministry? <laughs> <laughs> you see what I'm saying? I'm just telling people the, the hypocrisy of vain glory. This is what this devil did. This devil did to Jesus. I'm gonna give you all this glory. And I'm trying to say that's what some of these people do. So many people even become part of the head of ministries is because of vain glory. Yeah. Yeah. And that's that's people who 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 are called to minister are not called to be preachers. I mean, they're called yeah. to be pastors. No. You know, because yeah. everybody is called to be a minister. Yeah. Yes, sir. Everyone, you, you All of those are life, Then you're yeah. a minister of reconciliation, period. That, Come on that's now. your ministry. Mm -hmm. Period. Even a babe can, can, can minister. Yes, sir. Ambassadors for Christ. That's you know it. what I mean? We so, all are. The, the fact that we exclude mm. is 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 a very bad mark it is it is uh, it as, is. as as christians i mean now the exclusion is set by god mm. not by man no the exclusion is you eat of this tree <laughs> you're you separate. yes sir you know and so that was that was man's mistake, not God's mm. mistake. Mm. Then God put in these laws, and now men are using well, Satan is using these laws through men. Yes, sir. To condemn those. Yes, sir. Who would be saved? And yeah. so, and who you are, and so it's 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 so bad that the cycle of what happened when Christ mm. came and 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 <sighs> delivered and 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 was victorious in mm -hmm. it's still going on to this day. And I think that's why even they, they, when the Catholic Church was taken over by Rome, when Rome set up the, the ministry, all he did, they introduced man's institution into the gospel. The gospel is doing great yeah. without people, without a state yeah. sponsor. Oh, it and was thriving and growing, it was, it was growing all by itself. People sitting there being burnt at stakes, fed to the animals, you know, to tigers yeah. and all that other stuff, and they still kept growing. They tried to destroy all those manuscripts that were being copied and sent to people. They tried to burn all the things, and it still kept growing. And then all of a sudden, he realized, I can't beat them. Then what I'm going to do is join them yeah. to I'm us. I'm going them, and then I'm going to lead them astray. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm gonna incorporate the pagan things and everything. I'm gonna try. Oh, yeah. I am going to dilute. I'm gonna hide and put that gospel down as much as I can by putting all these rituals and everything else into it. That people will be focused on the rituals, the paganistic stuff, and everything else, and forget the word, forget the what's written, right? Because that's what we're talking about. The fact is that even Christ is saying, "I'm responding to you by what's written." You so well, okay. We 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 start looking at the pageantry. We start looking at the populism. You know what I mean? That's that's what he's trying to say. The vain glory. And talking about now, talking about even when we talk about racism, when people sit there and try to glorify the color of their skin. And I'm telling you, people, listen. This is not. This is he. We're gonna get we'll get an answer and then we'll close this. Is how Christ responded to what this doing this glorifying something. Glorifying your nationality, glorifying the color of your skin, glorifying your wealth, glorifying everything else instead of being what God calls you to be, what God well, says. Instead of be. glorifying the one and only thing that should be glorified, and that is God. Woo! And He said it in the Lord's prayer, didn't He? He He said it. This is the manner which you pray is thine is the kingdom yeah. and the power 
in the glory. That's he, all Jesus did. Glorify the Father so that the Father will glorify me. Exactly. And we sit there and get fed into the stuff from when you use nationalism, when you're using racism, when you're using anything else, just sit there and try to use that to justify putting other people down. I'm telling you, that is not God, people. It is not written. And I'm telling you, if you want to go by what's written, if you want to have a victorious Christian life, go by what's written in the Word of God because you all got to give an accountability. I got to give accountability. Brother Abson got accountability. And if we sit there and fall to the traps of Satan, and start worshiping him and you worship him by doing his will instead of god's will the things that i've done like when a police officer did that kill people i'm telling you police officer said if you do that you're not glorifying god you're glorifying the devil and, and then i'm talking about all those people in the past that did the lynching and all the other stuff what they doing brother i said who are they glorifying for say and the, the, the demonic actions that were done to a human being yeah. it, it, you, do you think they i know you don't think you'll glorify god huh they they they, it, they made it a festival and took joy <laughs> in the actions mm, to hold People on they, to they, a they, glory that's what that, that isn't that true though we really trying to say they did all that they joy rejoicing because it was a it was this glory similar to what this satan was trying to offer jesus Yes, you are, right? You look at, you think about, okay, the the, the uh, Roman soldiers that crucified, mm. did the crucify, they took joy in what they did. Yeah. You know, they, they, they did it with, with, you know, they had a passion for it. I mean, mm. they, they, they didn't have no feelings about what they did to these no. folks. Nope, they didn't. In you a lot know, of cases, they... they, they I mean, first you're going to beat them yep. through the squares and through the streets all the way there. You know, just punish, somebody's going to die and you're just going to punish them all the way through. More and more. Yep. To, you put them to, on, to, to the point to where you're going to exalt them up above everything to mm. show what you're, to show your, 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 your works. Yes, sir. Beat them. Yeah. And then to, to, to make sure they don't get down, they break their legs. Yes, sir. They did. They, they don't have... kill them. They just let them suffer to yeah. death. Yeah. No, they... no compassion. No nothing. No nothing. And and they threw them in. They threw those people in a, a bad in a ditch. Yeah, they threw them in a ditch. And 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 all the reason Christ didn't go in the ditch because a rich man said, "I'll take his body. Can I have his body?" Yeah, they look. They had the, the Romans had the audacity to, to to gamble uh, his for clothes the, away right in front for, of him for the for the last belongings <laughs> of this person. Yes, sir. And and uh, wow. and don't forget the don't forget the don't forget the the the, the uh, Hebrews or Jews. I guess it was Jews, not Hebrews at that time because it was Judah left yeah. and a little bit of Benjamin. They sitting there wagging their their heads and tail at them. Yeah, they said if you if you God come on down now, yeah. mocking him, probably throwing rocks at him. They probably would. They would, would those Roman soldiers in a way. That's the only reason why they didn't do it. Because they hit one of them, they would have been in trouble, right? Well, yeah. That's. But they they mocked him. They mocked him. Yeah. All yeah. for what though? To keep their power. And it wasn't really to keep their power. Well, there was some that were trying to maintain power. Yes, but sir, they were. a mob mentality that went on as well. Yeah, when they're talking about crucify them, they had, they had a yeah. yeah, they said put the, but they, they, they said this Pharisees and the, and, the, and the Pharisees and the ones that, that stirred oh, yeah. them up though. So yeah. it was, they were just riled up. I mean, they were supposed to be, uh, they were supposed to be the religious leaders. They were supposed they, to be well, the they leaders. Were, they, he was the opposition. And yeah. he was he was taking away their authority, and they chose a murderer over yeah. him, over him, a known murderer over a man Someone who, who did had no miracles. Authority. Someone Come on who now. Didn't, had no threat against their authority. And, he blessed and, people, yeah. miracles too. You see, what I'm saying that he did miracles. He fed people by the thousand, 
And yet they chose a murderer. They chose the nature of man over Christ. Yeah, they chose. They chose. They chose death. They chose. They chose Cain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they did, didn't they? Didn't they? That's what they did. And, over Abel. And and, and 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 so I'm just saying that when we talk about trying to glorify flesh and everything else, all we're sitting there doing is taking what Satan is offering. And I call it vain glory. So get to, as we wrap it up, what was the answer that Christ gave, sir? He said, Get thee hence, Satan, for it is written, Thou shalt worship the Lord thy God, and him only shalt thou only. serve. Yes. Then the devil leaveth him, and behold, mm -hmm. angels came and ministered unto him. Yes, sir. And that's similar to you saying that the devil would resist the devil and he would flee. Yeah. That's what they, that, in this particular case, he resisted them, but he resisted them by the word of God. You see what I'm saying? And I'm just saying this for all of us, you're not perfect. And here's another thing about passing the test. I want to show you, I want to throw something else at you too. A lot of us rejoice when other people fail the test. Some people waiting for you to fail a test. Oh, yeah. And then, could then they could sit there and say, see, see, see? He said, so you have no mercy toward one another. That's why you're supposed to be able to sit there and show that all of us are fallible. All of us yeah. can make mistakes. And the fact that they take joy until you missing the mark because they couldn't keep it. You know, that, 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 makes, that makes them feel good about themselves. Mm. You know, it barely does. It deflects from you to them. It puts attention on you, and they think that. And they think that you. So that means I remember one guy. I remember one time I built, and uh, when I was uh, active duty, and I was talking about some uh, uh, particular area where uh, you remember some of those soldiers, airmen, for your case, where they they messed up and. They had those domestic disputes in, in their homes where you might even have a spouse run up on somebody who was messing with their spouse or 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 a ex or a, a person that's extra comes to somebody's home and, and beat up the other person's spouse because they're claiming them, you know, they're gonna take it by force. And and the guy sit there and say, uh, how do you know so much about that? You're like, what? What do you say? <laughs> I do you mean you mean I have to? You mean I have to be that to talk about that? You, I, I need to be that to say that we shouldn't do that. That that, that what you're telling me? Because I'm I'm not understanding where you're coming from. When you ask that question, but you, you you I'm trying to show you what the Word of God says. And I was talking, I'm basic ministry and stuff like that. And people had the audacity to sit there and think that. Well, only way you can know I understand that is you had to do it yourself. And all I'm trying to say is that people, let's not bite each other because we fail somewhere on a test. Let's work on restoring people to the best of our ability. Because yeah. nobody's perfect that I'm aware of. Yeah, we're, we're all in this war. We, you know, yes, sir. It's a spiritual a, war. A fellow, a fellow soldier falls, mm -hmm. you get to him. You don't, don't stab him because he's... We, you see what I'm saying? We, we circle the, we circle like wolves when the yeah. blood is drawn. Somebody make a mistake now, now the, they, they, they're going around in circles. Yeah, they eat their own. Yes, sir. They do. That's what people do. And people go for vain glory. That's all I'm just trying to say that that last temptation is telling you something. But the answer, the response is what I'm really trying to tell you is when you're tempted, use the word of god what is written right Amen. if somebody tempt you some some beautiful hot hottie come up and and, and tempt you you can say what is written that, that god hates adultery matter of fact the ten commandments said thou shalt not commit adultery baby I, I i hear where you're coming from and i agree your temptation but it's written Matter of fact, get the hands behind me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I think we could, but at the same time, I think that would be the be, best thing to say. Keep it moving. 
<laughs> Ooh, that's true too. Or flee, right? Better say flee. Look, look, make it make it known. You know, you're being used to say it because it, 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 it's not of God. It's not of God because it's not written. So tell me what you offer me is written. So God wouldn't do that. He wouldn't put that on me. Come on now. Come on. In my fact, in most cases, our temptation things that he knows that uh, at least the devil knows he ain't gonna come at you that way. He didn't come at Adam that way, did he? No. He, he like, let me go to Eve. Let me go. <laughs> let me go over here and get her. <laughs> That's how the enemy works. But I'm just concerned that in closing out of this last one is the enemy lacks to offer you vain glory. And I'm trying to say, if you operate in a situation where people try to tell you, you know, like somebody try to tell you you're nothing, then you tell them it is written, I am something. Yeah. And somebody said that you, you, you're you not saved, you say, well, it's written, I am saved. Matter of fact, I like this, Christ died, it's written, he died for them, he came for the ungodly. Yeah, that's what that, he said. That, that, huh? That's what he said. He said that's what he said. Go. He said. Y'all don't need a physician. I can't those who need a physician. <laughs> right. <laughs> and we should be we should be the ones that feel like they don't need a physician is to point the people to the physician that need them. What we want to do, we want to crucify them. We, we want to chastise them. We want to condemn them. We want to keep them out. But that's not what's written, is it? He told us, go preach the gospel. Go preach the good news. Bless people. Huh? Bless one another. I would always submit that people should start blessing men. You're gonna bless ministry, bless you individually. And I'm talking about you, Brother Addison. He's a minister. He's a ministry himself. Uh, did you? In other words, the congregation. Maybe y'all start blessing one another because where the needs are, bless them. Because you're not blessing it for yourself. You planting seeds for your. You know, you plant the harvest for yourself isn't it that's what i'm saying just start think about that that's all i'm saying but i think we can walk over this is is how we respond by what's written don't argue with people anymore just say what's written then you talk to me about what's written and then you know how somebody tried to write the you know how those uh some of those ministries out there especially with the i guess the black hebrews sometimes they thought take you all these scriptures right <laughs> <laughs> you, I think you should sit there and stick with your scripture. My scripture said it is written this. Yeah. Now yeah. I need you to deal with that. I don't need you to take me to Timbuktu. Yeah. I need you to tell me deal with this. You know, yeah. and that's I think how we can deal with life. Just to go by what's written. That that sounds fair. Let's just go. I mean, you can nip it all in the bud. Let's just go to to, to Genesis. Ooh. God made man. Yeah in his own image, in the likeness of God made he yes sir that's who I am <laughs> yes sir them. Whoa. and that's and then, who you are and then let's, let's go from there mm -hmm. <laughs> let's, let's start off with that because that is his will his will was that you was created to be blessed people so you blessed and you're gonna be have a blessed week and you enjoy yourself and remember Jesus Yeshua is Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you.